following video will give you some tips on troubleshooting your fireplace fan system. First, let's talk about safety. It's important to remember that fireplace fans are usually 120 volts, so please take the precautions necessary to ensure you're not in danger of being shocked. Always remember to turn the power off, shut off the breaker, or unplug the cord before handling the fan or other components. It is important to know what components your fan system has to properly diagnose the problem. Most fireplace fan kits consist of three parts. The fan or blower, which circulates the air around the fireplace and projects the heated air into the room. The on-off switch and or fan speed control, which will vary the speed of the fans and may have an off setting. And the heat sensor. A heat sensor will usually start the fans between 5 to 15 minutes after startup and will also turn the fans off when the fireplace cools down. Please note that fan systems vary and your system may not include all of these components. If you think about the movement of electricity through the components, you can simplify things through the process of elimination. Under normal circumstances, turning on the system will cause the fireplace to heat up and in turn, heat up the heat sensor if one is installed within the system. The heat sensor will then take about 5 to 15 minutes to heat before turning on the fans. The fan speed control will then determine the speed of the fans. If your system includes a fan speed control, Ensure that it is not set to the off position, as this will prevent the fan from running. Most components will be connected by simple plug-and-play wiring. Let's start by ensuring you have power at the source. You can do this with an electricity probe or sensor, or you can plug in another small appliance like a desk lamp to make sure there's power to the plug-in. Once you have determined that there's power at the outlet, the heat sensor is the first component you should check. Incidentally, this will be one of the least expensive and most commonly replaced components. First, turn on the fireplace, then wait about 5 to 15 minutes to ensure that the heat sensors had enough time to heat up. If the fan turns on, the problem may simply be that the heat sensor was not given adequate time. If the fan still does not work, eliminating the heat sensor from the circuit would be the next step. Ensure that the fan sensor is cooled down completely before handling. Power down the system, shut off the breaker, or unplug the cord. Remove the heat sensor from the circuit by unplugging the wires and using a jumper wire to complete the circuit. Power the system up again and see if the fan works. If you remove the heat sensor from the circuit and the fan starts working, the heat sensor should be replaced. If you have bypassed the heat sensor and the fan still doesn't run, it's time to check the fan speed control. Again, power down the system, shut off the breaker, or unplug the cord. Remove the fan speed control from the circuit and use a jumper wire to complete the circuit. Power the system up again and see if the fan works. If the fan works with a jumper wire, the fan speed control should be replaced. If, after bypassing all components, the fan still will not work, it's the fan that needs replacing. If you have any other questions, please contact us at fire-parts.com.